Hey, what's up everyone? It's definitely not Anthony Fantano here with another music review, but this time it's Wallow's World with his own music review of his favorite tracks this week of September 4th. I've been trying to find a niche with this channel. Don't really exactly have one. I've been kind of going all over the place, but uh, personally, I feel as if this is the way to go for me in terms of finding some form of enjoyment in this channel and hoping to see some progress because I like music and I listen to it a lot and I watch uh, those music review channels respectively so I thought I'd dive into the hole myself. But first off we're gonna start off with uh, the hot fresh new mixtape from Detroit's own Big Sean with one of my more favorite singles from the project called Dawn Life featuring Lil Wayne. I really like the production from Greg Romanek on this song who's also had his fair show of work with Big Sean before working on songs back in 20 since like 2014 with Dark Sky Paradise. It's got a really strong feel to it and even starting off with the to the paper like it's human nature. God damn no more the haters that just motivate us. I know revenge tastes the sweetest but I'm going to save us. I'm just sending all my graces up to my creator. No negotiation this is world domination. You bringing in this hard instrumental and Lil Wayne doing his usual due diligence of going off on a feature with Big Sean. This is probably my favorite song off off the whole project. I got about like four of them, so. And then next up we have uh, Hold On Tight by Allo Black from his upcoming album, All Of Everything. To be honest, I haven't heard an Allo Black song in a while, but I am glad I'm able to discover this and it gives off this come together feeling with the background singers and these smooth drums. It sounds like something you'd hear on church on Sunday morning from like a non-denominational white people church but I would recommend it to anyone who's into a more softer and easier boom clap style of things, you know? Like if Imagine, like if Imagine Dragons went to Bible study, that kind of thing. And then there's Inhale by Bryson Tiddler. With this song releasing, fans are assuming that he could be coming out with a new project sometime soon, which I personally hope so too. But this song definitely sounds like something inspired from the late artist Aaliyah or like TLC or something, but with its own modern twist. With its with its twisted, distorted lyrics, it shows a more wavy side to Bryson Tiller, and even though the lyrics were a bit weak, it still all came together to make a decent comeback single for him, and hopefully the next project that he does will carry on the same kind of element. Then next up, we have the song Red Card by Frisco, Skepta, Jammer, Jammy, and Shorty. This sounds like something you hear on like the next FIFA installment, but you will remember far beyond that game. It's quick bars from each of these UK grime artists just go to show that even in the UK they can really go off. I really like Skepta and Jammy verses for most of them all. Uh, like usual, they always seem to deliver on their songs and make this one of my most favorite posse cuts and songs for a while. Everyone on the song supports each other very well, just as you would be supporting me by liking this video. For the fifth song on this list, we have Self Control by Paper Dragon. It carries this fast paced, poppy like beat that makes me want to like get up and dance or something. I like the trumpets in the background. I feel as if they carry the energy of the song that you'd want, and the lead singer sounds very nice. For this to be my first time hearing a Paper Dragon's band, I'm not disappointed, and I hope to hear more new stuff from them soon. Lastly, we have Children of the Void by Ramirez and Sos Mula. The song reminds me of the Red Dot song from uh, Ramirez's late pro latest project, The Player's Manual, that I also liked. Its weird lyrics and strong instrumental both play into Ramirez and Sos Mula's hands, so that's why I believe this song is pretty well done. I wish it would have been longer because it's only a few seconds short of two minutes, but overall this song is one of my favorites from this week and hopefully you guys can appreciate it just as much as I did. I want to thank y'all for watching this video. Um, I am trying something a little bit new here. Uh, sorry if I'm taking like the super duper Fantano out right here, but I mean, I do like music and I do like to review music a lot. I mean, if you, you know, so these are just songs that I picked out that I discovered this week. And uh, hopefully y'all are able to appreciate these songs just as much as I did. Um, I just want to thank y'all to be able to just even stay and consistently watch this channel. It does mean a lot to me. I mean, what, I got like 10,000 views and 277 subs. <laughs> um, hopefully one day we can be just as big as Fantano, maybe even bigger, as big as Sean C. I don't care. I, I would preferably want to beat Sean C because he is a dweeb. But, um, yeah, uh, thank y'all for watching. Y'all like and subscribe. And y'all have a great day. Enjoy the songs.
Ooh. Get the trying to be. She wanna be. Gum, gum, gum. Maybe she's a ginger.